good evening students i welcome you all on behalf of learn to lead academy on this 50 days preparation strategy and now so as you know all know the exam dates for december mat has been released the they are going to conduct one pbt two cbt and three ibt and ppt means paper based test okay the test date for pbt is on 9th december you can apply for the test till 5th december and you can download your admit card until 7th december and cbt 1 schedule the last date to apply for cbt 1 is 28th november and the test date is on 3rd december you can download your admit card from 30th november cbt 2 test date falls on 16th december those who have just started your preparation and those who need time for your preparation you can apply with cbt2 schedule because the results for all the examination will be released all together after completing all the test schedules okay right so those who have started your preparation just now you can apply for cbt2 test and the test is on 16th december so you will get nearly 2 months time from today nearly 60 days of time you will get if you uh, apply for cbt2 schedule okay now and for this cbt2 schedule you can apply till 11th december and you can download your admit card from 13th december ibt1 first ibt is on 6th december IBT is nothing but internet based test if you have good internet connection from your home you can write the exam from your home itself right so the first IBT test date is on 6th december you can apply for the last date to apply for this IBT is 3rd december you can download your admit card from 4th december IBT 2 schedule that is IBT 2 test date is on 9th december Okay so the last date is to apply for IBT2 is 6th December and you can download your admit card from 7th December and IBT3 schedule 17th December okay uh, IBT3 test is on 17th December you can download your admit card from 15th December and the last date is 14th December okay so those who have just now started with your preparation you can apply for cbt2 schedule 16th december or ibt3 or ibt2 okay whenever it is convenient for you you can check with your dates and you can apply okay see usually this mat exam is conducted by aima all india management association the test is conducted in three modes ibt that is internet based test paper based test cbt test okay if you want to apply for this exam okay if you want to uh, write any one either ibt or cbt or pbt 2100 rupees is the charge for this exam and also they are providing an additional opportunity like you can take two ibts one pbt and one cbt one ibt plus pbt and one ibt plus cbt if you are planning to write two sessions okay you need to pay extra 1200 the charge will be around 3300 if you are planning to take two tests and the best of the score and with the best score you can apply for your colleges okay the best of the two you can consider and that with and with that you can apply for your colleges okay now so what are the essential documents that is required for applying for your mat examination scanned image of photograph scanned image of signature and you should have a credit card and or debit card for net banking details to apply mat examination so there are five sections in mat exams mathematical skills verbal ability intelligence and critical reasoning data analysis and sufficiency in the and global environment and as i told you earlier the test is conducted in three modes internet based test computer based test paper based test and the duration of test is around 2 hours 30 minutes number of questions 200 okay so you'll get plus 1 for every correct answer and there is also negative market uh, marking minus 0.25 
okay so as i told you there are five sections in math examination the sections are mathematical skills language comprehension data analysis and sufficiency intelligence and critical reasoning indian and global environment in total there are 200 questions 200 marks you need to write and the time allotted is 150 minutes and keep it in mind that there is no sectional timing in this examination okay and now see so if you are looking for the best online math coach uh, online coaching you can contact 8870046080 and now what are the course module and what are the topics you need to cover for the upcoming math examination and as you all know there are two sections based on math exam the section 1 is numerical ability section 2 data interpretation sufficiency the two sections are based on arithmetic okay so and in section 1 numerical ability you will get application oriented questions 40 questions you will get and as of now we have 20 topics so almost from each topic minimum you can expect two questions and maximum three questions from each topic okay so the topics which you need to cover are pipes and system ages reminder theorem lens ration partnership probability venn diagram time and work percentage boards and streams time speed and distance trigonometry prime based problems allegation and mixture average time speed and distance race based problems permutation and combination algebra lcm and hcf simple interest and compound interest so these are the topics you should cover for your upcoming math examination and our kind advice is first be thorough with your basic arithmetic ability okay so the basic arithmetic ability in the sense you should know the basic divisibility rules and basic shortcuts for multiplication and fast addition okay only if you are thorough with your basic numerical ability you can attempt at least 35 questions in the numerical ability topic because it is not that much easy to attempt all the 40 questions in 2 and a half hours see within that 2 and a half hours you need to attend numerical ability reasoning and verbal ability and also data interpretation so 160 questions you need to attempt in 150 minutes so you cannot spare at least one minute in a question okay it differs okay right so the strategy is see if you take these four sections mathematical skills language comprehension data analysis and sufficiency intelligence and critical reasoning see there are also 40 questions based on indian and global environment so the marks are not considered for indian and global environment section so uh, it is not advisable to omit the section completely so try to attend few questions whatever you know in the under indian and global environment okay now if you take mathematical skills 40 questions will be asked under mathematical skills okay in these 40 questions if you want to attempt at least 30 plus practices are needed okay so if i neglect indian and global environment the remaining four sections are there mathematical skills language comprehension data analysis and sufficiency intelligence and critical reasoning so under four sections you need to cover 160 questions 160 questions you need to attempt in 150 minutes that is the strategy okay so for language comprehension under language comprehension what you have to do is at uh, see for few questions which are based on error spotting or vocabulary you should attempt each questions within 10 seconds as fast as possible you should be able to attempt okay you should be attend to uh, the whole two and a half hour session then only you can give a reasonable good attempt okay and also intelligence and critical reasoning some basic topics like you you should try to solve puzzles okay definitely uh, in the reason time they are asking three to four questions based on puzzles a puzzles based on arrangement okay so try to work out so if you are starting with your preparation just now so as we all wake up daily uh, so as we all wake up early daily and we brush our teeth regularly right without brushing brushing our teeth we don't start our day right as like that so if you are going to start your preparation just now what you have to do is you should start with the basic 
concepts like daily you should work out two reading comprehension two puzzles you should be able to work out and two data and the preparation questions you should be able to work out that is the mantra you have to follow okay if you do this definitely you can cover and score major part of the mathematical section part okay that everything will come only by practice okay and now under intelligence and critical reasoning section these are the topics you have to cover puzzle assertion and reasoning statement codes of action statement argument blood relationship conversation type and also the three types of questions will be based on blood relationship I try to cover all the questions handshake problem coding and decoding arrangement directions and cubes and cuboids arrangement based on building okay so these are the questions see uh, definitely only i have given 11 topics and most in these topics the questions will be repeated so be thorough with these topics okay so verbal ability in the grammar the questions are of this form okay so first reading comprehension minimum two reading comprehension you can expect under verbal ability okay and then synonym and antonym choose a word or phrase meaning nearest to the underlined part and fill in the blanks one word substitution choose the option that best and then idioms and phrase summary order the sentence into logical paragraph okay and vocabulary parts of speech articles prepositions tenses conjunctions active and passive voice direct and indirect speech error spotting rules okay so these are the topics you should be thorough under verbal ability okay now so just go through all the grammar basic topics for securing marks which were asked based on the questions based on grammar okay just go through all that and to develop your vocabulary the thing is you have to solve that is you have to work out at least two to three reading comprehension paragraph so that you can attempt reading comprehension as well as when you learn new vocabulary uh it will be very helpful okay instead of learning taking a dictionary and writing all the new words and writing its meaning it is very tough right it's tough to remember all the new words okay but you should see uh you should be able to approach those reading comprehension in application oriented view okay va wow. right now so this was useful to you all and we are very proud to announce our last year results may mat examination results Okay, Sathika, our student has secured seven sixty six point five zero, and actually, uh, uh, she she is studying now in PhD Institute of Management. So the college has expected six hundred. Actually, uh, she took February attempt, but as she was as her score was less than five hundred, the college needed six hundred above score, right? So she joined the batch the month of February. in may examination she scored 766.50 in the mat examination and keshavan he scored 642.50 jeevitan 640.50 manish kumar 638.50 so these are our few results to secure good score in the previous year mat examination and we are studying in very uh, top notch colleges okay so if you want to join our 50 days online crash course You can contact double eight seven double zero four six zero eight zero directly, or you can also visit our website learntolead. Okay. All the best, students. Yes, a uh, few have asked few doubts. Total score for Mac seven twenty, and Mac, which is the best method to score more marks? Attending more questions or attending only known questions? So you should get a good. Uh, that is, it is uh, based on the colleges which are looking for. Most of the top colleges are expecting six hundred above. So the last year, this uh, their expectation were around a six hundred above. So definitely, this time also, the colleges will expect six hundred more. So to get six hundred more. uh you have to give at least in out of 160 questions 120 questions and above minimum 120 questions and above you have to give a good attempt okay and the thing is it is not easy to score good marks in mat exam the only thing is you need practice more okay you should have a good practice before taking your mat exam that is my point
Okay, any other doubt? Okay, ma. Thank you all. Thank you all for joining this webinar. Bye.